So the big grass court tournament's underway on the men's side. We go back to a 500 event in Queens Club. Huge, huge event in England. We already went through what's going to happen in Hella. Very, very stacked event. This one also has a pretty big name involved as well. Let's go have a look at who's not playing though because some players have pulled out. So only one player has pulled out and that's Lehechka. Of course, he had to pull out of the French Open due to an injury, a back problem. So that seems to be continuing on and unfortunately, he won't be playing here. All right, taking a look at the top of the draw, we've got eight seeds in this one. Nobody gets a buy in the first round. Carlos Alcaraz, he's the number one seed in this one. One, of course, defending champion. He plays on Sarundalo in the first round. Very dangerous first round. Sarundalo was top 20 not too long ago, so very dangerous for Elkris there. Winner of that will take on either Navone, Draper in the second round. Then you got Tabilo taking on Davidovich Vakina. Winner of that will take on either Baez, the number five seed Paul in the second round. Then you got Dimitrov, the third seed, taking on Manorino. Winner of that will take on either Korda or Hashinov in the second round. Then you got to qualify taking on Tiafo. Winner of that will take on either Rinaldi or the number eight seed Umber in the second round. Really interesting draw. A lot of these guys playing grass for the first time this year. Of course, some of these guys. Guys played grass last week. Draper being one of them. Had a very good week last week. On Bear's very dangerous for grass. I mean, there's some really, really interesting names here. But, of course, you got to watch out for Alcaraz in this one. you got to watch out for on Bear. Also, Dimitrov as well. Can play on the grass. Also, watch out for Tommy Paul. So, the seed's all there. But I'll be watching out for Draper. I'll be waiting, watching out for Quarter as well. Both have made finals of grass court events this week. Very, very dangerous. And potentially could play those top seeds in the second round. So, really, really weird and scary draw for some of the big names. Bottom half of the draw now, you've got the number seven seed, Runa. He'll take on Thompson in the first round. Winner of that will take on either Murray qualifier in the second round. Then you got Rayonic taking on Nori. Winner of that will take on either a qualifier or the number four seed Fritz in the second round. Then you got the number six seed Shelton taking on a qualifier. Winner of that will take on either Echeverry or Harris in the second round. Then you got Evans taking on Nakashima. Winner of that will take on either Musetti or the number two seed Demon Or. And of course, Musetti's been doing well this week on grass. So is Demon Or. So that's a crazy first round right there. But again, players to watch out for. You gotta watch out for Demon Or. You gotta watch out for Runa, of course. Fritz and Shelton, the Americans can play on grass. We've seen, especially Fritz, have very good success on on grass, especially a couple years ago at Wimbledon. But some of the unseated players. Obviously, you've got to watch out for Andy Murray on grass. I mean, on any surface, but on grass, especially at home. He can be very dangerous early on in the tournament. Also, watch out for Raonic. Had a really, really good week last week coming back onto the grass with that service. Super, super dangerous. And like I said, you've got to watch out for Musetti. He's had a really good week this week as well. It could be dangerous on the grass. So... Really, really interesting draw. Again, a lot of players are playing grass for the first time since playing on clay. And a lot of these guys played last week. So it could be an interesting mix of players and interesting mix of form going in. So not as crazy as the Heller draw, but still massive names playing in this one. And usually this is the only tournament that these big names play. The top 10 only usually play one big event before Wimbledon because they just don't have the time. You know, three weeks to get ready for Wimbledon. And this is the middle week. Next week, everybody takes a week off for the most part, unless somebody's desperate for form. But man, it's an interesting draw. Alcaraz, of course, won this tournament last Last year was a little bit of a surprise after what he did at the French and also cramping at the French last year, if you remember. He's now, the you know, coming off of the French Open champion. So can he convert to the grass as quickly as he did last year? I guess we'll find out. But man, who are you going to pick in this one? Are you going to pick Elkraz? Just because he is the defending champion. He improved last year, winning Wimbledon as well, that going from clay to grass is not that hard for him. Maybe someone a little different. Maybe someone like a Fritz. Maybe a Demon or who's been in good form this week. Maybe you want to go with an unseated play. Maybe you want to go with Andy Murray. Maybe he can make a dream run here in Queens Club. He has won this title a bunch before, but there's a draw for Queens Club. Really interesting draw and interested to see how this draw plays out.